Welcome back to another video. I'm your tech guide, Wayne. Today I'll be showing you how to erase all of your data off of the Samsung Galaxy A14 and how to basically reset it back to factory settings. And this sets the phone up if you're in the process of either giving the phone um, back to the store or you're trying to sell it to someone or trade it in. These are the steps you'll need to take to make sure all your data is safely and securely removed off of the phone before you pass it to the next person. So let's step in and let me show you what you'll need to do. Follow the steps in order because I'm gonna do a few things that are super important to again, make sure you protect your data and make sure you erase all your data properly. Now, let's swipe down from the top of the screen. Upper right corner, we're gonna tap on this settings wheel right here. Now, the first thing we'll need to do is swipe all the way up to accounts and backup. From here, we're then going to tap on manage accounts. On this screen, you'll see all of the accounts that you have signed into on the phone. The most important account you need to focus on here is the any Google account. Now, right now, I just have one Google account, but you might have multiple Google accounts and you also may have other accounts that you're signed into. The important thing is all the, the Google or Gmail accounts, you need to tap on them and you need to hit remove account. Um, if you don't remove the Google accounts, then you will um, brick the phone and basically make it unusable for the next person. And this could also affect you trying to trade your phone in. So make sure you do this first step first. It's super important. Now next, we're gonna hit the back button here and I want to show you there's an option on the screen here that's called Extor external storage transfer. Now, um, there's also a backup data option. Now, you want to make sure that you have um, backed up all of your information before you reset the phone because there is no way to access it after we do the final step. So, if you haven't done this already, um, a few things to look at. You can back up your data to your Google Drive by tapping here, and you can also back up your data here by tapping on external storage drive. If you have a micro SD card, just looks like this. You can put it in the phone and use Samsung's app to back up all your data before you erase the phone. Um, the other option is obviously if you've purchased a new phone and you're trying to move your data over to that new phone, if it's a Samsung, you can do it using one of these two options. So that's just important to note. After you have successfully uh, moved your data over or backed up your data, you're gonna tap on the reset button at the bottom of the screen here, right above Samsung Cloud. This will take you to the reset page and you'll want to tap on factory data reset. From here, it'll actually show you all the apps that you've been signed into on the phone. And it's telling you once you hit that reset button, it's going to sign you out of all of these accounts. So I'm going to hit the reset button. It will ask you to enter your PIN number uh, before the final um, reset starts. So go ahead and enter your PIN number. After you've done that, you'll tap on the delete all button and that is it. This will trigger the factory reset and it's going to erase all your data off the phone. Now this could take anywhere from two minutes to 10 minutes depending on how much data you had on the phone. So don't touch the phone, just let it sit and let it go through its process. It's going to restart a few times and you will know the factory reset was successful. When you get to the last screen and it's gonna basically say welcome and it's gonna say select a language. So once you've gotten there, you'll know your reset was successful. Hope you guys found this helpful. If it was, hit that like button down below if it was. If you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care and as always, have a good one.